my soul and all that is within me bless his holy name you glad to be in the service one more time it's good to be here God has been good to us he's allowed us to come together one more time we want to acknowledge our sister's church in Lakeland and also our pastor we ought to stand and give our pastor a, a, a big hand the honorable Bishop Kenneth Groover the work he's doing. Hallelujah. We love you. We want to say a special welcome to our social media audience. Uh, we ask that if you're happy and you enjoy the service, like, share, and send it to your friends and your family. If you're ever in the area, please join us and we hope to make you feel welcome. This time we'll have our opening hymn by our praise team. Stand and join in.
God. He's the name above all names. And he is worthy. How many believe that the Lord is worthy to be praised? We serve a worthy God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This time we offer prayer in the sanctuary. If you have a prayer request, put your name in the comments and we'll be sure to pray for you. Bowing our heads, Lord, we thank you. We thank you for life, health, and strength. We thank you for the activity of our lives. We thank you for being in our right mind. God, we thank you for everything that you've done for us. God, if you didn't do it, it wouldn't have been done. God, we want to acknowledge that you did it for us. God, we love you. We appreciate you. We adore you. We glorify your name. God, come in this house today. Healed by the power of your word. Save somebody. Deliver somebody, Jesus. Set free by the power of your word. God, we know you're able to do it. You said where two or three are gathered together in your name. You will be in the midst. God, have your way in this service. Flow through this place. God, come through like never before. God, shake up something in this place. Break up the fallow ground. God, we know that you're able to do it. Heal our bodies, God. Touch our minds. God, free us. Free us that we may be able to work within the power that you've given us. God, do it for us today and we'll forever praise you and give your name the glory. Give your name the honor and give your name the praise. In Jesus' name we pray to the glory of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's a glory cloud in this house. Hallelujah. His glory is here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's going to be a miracle today. It's going to be a miracle today. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This time we're going to read the scripture. It's coming from Psalms 29 and 1. We'll read together. Give unto the Lord, O ye mighty. Give unto the Lord glory and strength. Give unto the Lord the glory due unto his name. Worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. The voice of the Lord is upon the waters. The God of glory thundereth. The Lord is upon the many waters. The voice of the Lord is powerful. The voice of the Lord is full of majesty. The voice of the Lord breaketh the cedars. Yea, the Lord breaketh the cedars of Lebanon. He maketh them also to skip like a calf, Lebanon and Syrian like a young unicorn. The voice of the Lord divideth the flames of fire. The voice of the Lord shaketh the wilderness. The Lord shaketh the wilderness of Kadesh. The voice of the Lord maketh the hinds of calf the, and discovereth the forest. And in his temple doth every one speak of his glory. The Lord sitteth upon the flood. Yea, the Lord sitteth king forever. The Lord will give strength unto his people. The Lord will bless his people with peace. The Lord had a blessing to the reader and the hearer and the doer of his word. Hallelujah. This time we'll recite our mission statement. To evangelize the world for Jesus Christ to equip every believer to become a true disciple of Christ and to engage those social problems that challenge the communities we have been called to serve. This time we'll get a song from our praise team. You, you can keep standing if you like. Uh, let's enjoy this glory cloud. Let's, let's, let's give God a, a, a big praise. All right?
All hail the King of Glory. All hail the Great I Am. All hail the King of Glory. He reigns forever and evermore. There's none like him. There's none beside him. He reigns all alone. Hallelujah. He sits on the throne. He don't have to have a council meeting to make any decisions. His thoughts towards you are thoughts of peace to bring you into an expected end. You have an expected end. You're going to prosper. You will be healed. You will be the lender and not the borrower. What does the Bible say? The Bible says that about you. And that person that's the king of glory, he died for us. He died for me. He died for me. Hallelujah. This time, we'll have our offering. Give the Lord a praise for offering time. We have an opportunity to give. Give unto the Lord. Reach way down into your secret place and give the Lord a sacrifice. Let him know how much you appreciate it. Because if you give, it'll be given back to you. Pressed down, shaken together, and running over when you ain't given to your bosom. How many of you believe that? The Lord loves a cheerful giver. I'm glad to give. Would you all stand once you have your seed? Hold it up in your right hand. And those of you who are giving electronically, you hold it up also. Hold up your phone, your device as a sign of unity. We we'll pray. Lord, we thank you for these blessings that you've allowed us. Thank you for your grace and your mercy. Thank you for the opportunity to give back to your service. God, we ask that you bless the hands that desire to give. Bless the hands that do give. Help it return it back to them. 10, 40, 100 fold. Help it to run over. God, help them to not have room enough to receive. In Jesus' name, amen. You are under the direction of the ushers.
when they're about to play an instrument to sit on the edge of their seats. Their back should not be on their chairs. Um, they're not sitting with, with the spirit of expectation, but they're sitting with the spirit of performance. But I think the same thing applies to us. Um, when you expect something, you, you, you're not in a lazy or a lethargical mood. But I know there's a word for us today. And I believe if you are in an active and an expectation mood, you will receive something from the word. I do see a cloud of glory in this house, but you have to get under the cloud. Our pastor is capable of giving us the word and, 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 and delivering it to us. So when he comes, sit with the spirit of expectation. And after the voice of the praise team, we receive that of our pastor, the Honorable Bishop Kenneth Gruber. Receive them by saying amen.
above every name. The Bible says that at the name of Jesus, every knee has to bow. Every tongue has to confess that Jesus is Lord to the glory of God the Father. There's nobody like him, y'all. He's excellent. He's excellent. He is excellent. He is excellent. Hallelujah. Praise him for him. Hallelujah. He's an excellent God. Nobody like him. Aren't you glad today? Praise the Lord. There's nobody like him. I don't have to serve another God. Praise the Lord, I'll be in competition with another God trying to get my attention, but there's only one. He said, I am that I am. Praise the Lord, you want to find something, praise the Lord, that will not move, that will not, amen, lose its foundation. Jesus said, I am the way. You stand on me, you'll never fall. Praise the Lord, you'll always have security. In the Lord Jesus Christ. Are you glad to be here today? Praise the Lord. I was glad when they said to me, let us go to the house of the Lord. God bless you today as we pray together, as we seek the will of God together. God will give us the miracle we desire. Praise the Lord. God know what you need before you ask him. But he said, ask, ask, and it shall be given. Seek, and you will find, not the door will be open. Father, we thank you today for the invitation to come, to ask you for whatever we will. You said you would do it. You said, if you ask anything according to my will, I'll make a way for you. I pray today, Lord, you grant peace to your people. You grant peace. Give us understanding to know that all things work together for the good. Them who love God, those who are called according to his purpose. We thank you for peace today. We thank you for salvation. We thank you. For being a way maker, we thank you. Hallelujah. We pray for a miracle today. We pray for healing in our bodies. We pray you will touch in the name of Jesus. Let those who are unchurched, unsaved, amen, find their way to the Lord Jesus Christ. Save in this hour, save in this time. Go across the airways, Lord. Bring deliverance to those who are bound. Do it for us and our Lord, and we give you glory. All the church shout hallelujah. Come on, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, bless the Lord. Hallelujah. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord today. I give honor, amen, to our Lord Jesus Christ and to all the saints of God. Praise the Lord to the mothers today, our deacons, and to all of our visitors who are here with us. Amen. To all of the elders, I thank God for you. Amen. For your presence here today. Amen. The Lord has blessed us. Amen. Understand that, praise the Lord, assembling ourselves together, praise the Lord, brings victory. It brings a relationship like no other. Praise the Lord. You could have stayed home and watched the YouTube or watched the Facebook. Or, praise the Lord. But you decided to be in the house of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Isn't that a blessing today? Praise the Lord. I don't have anything against Facebook. But when God give us the opportunity to be together, there's nothing like being here together. Seeing one another, loving on one another, 
Amen. Let one, of them, one another know how much we appreciate them. Praise the Lord for all they do for the kingdom. Isn't the Lord good today, y'all? Praise the Lord. I want to look at a few scriptures today. Um, let's turn to the book of Mark. And, and may we just stay in, in Mark. Mark chapter number 9. We'll begin at verse 17, Mark 9. We've been studying about faith, what really moves God is when we have faith in God. Amen. One of the multitude answered and said, Master, I have brought unto thee my son which hath a dumb spirit. And wheresoever he taketh him, he teareth him, and he foameth and gnash with his teeth, and pineth away. And I spake to thy disciples that they should cast him out, and they could not. He answered and said unto them, O faithless generation, how long shall I be with you? Bring him to me. And they brought him unto him. When he saw him, straightway the spirit tear him. And he fell on the ground and wallow for me. And he asked his father, how long is it ago since this came unto him? And he said, of a child. Off time, it has cast him into the fire and into the waters to destroy him. But if I can it do anything, have compassion on us and help us. Jesus said unto him, If thou canst believe, all things are possible to him that believe. And straightway, the father of the child cried out and said with tears, Lord, I believe. Help thou my unbelief. Hallelujah. And when Jesus saw that the people came running together, praise the Lord, he rebuked the foul spirit Say unto him, thy dumb and deaf spirit, I charge thee, come out of him, and enter no more into him. Praise the Lord. And the spirit cried and rent him sore and came out of him. And he was as one dead. In so much that many said, he is dead. But Jesus took him by the hand, lifted him up, and he arose. When he had come into the house, the disciples asked him privately, why could we not cast him out? He said unto them, this kind can come forth by nothing but by prayer and fasting. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank God for this example of faith. This young child who, amen, had been taken over by this spirit 
even as a child. The parents had brought him to Jesus, I mean to the disciples to cast him out, but they could not. That brings me to my text today. Faith breaks the stronghold of the enemy. Faith breaks the stronghold of the enemy. Jesus understood, praise the Lord, that the disciples could not cast him out because, praise the Lord, they were lacking some things because Jesus was there. You know, sometimes when the parent is there, praise the Lord, there's certain things the children, praise the Lord, don't have to worry about because the master's there. Yes. Hallelujah. And they understood, praise the Lord, and, and they may have been puzzled as to why they could not cast them out. Well, Jesus had given them commandment, go into all the world, preach the gospel. Gave them instruction they could cast out devils in his name. Praise the Lord. He had given them instructions and told them they'll be able to do this. But this son, this child, because of how much the parents loved him, they didn't just stop with the disciples. They said, I know we need to take him to Jesus. Praise the Lord. There's some things you got to take to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I, I want to just digress here for a minute because, praise the Lord, remember the Holy Ghost had not been given. The disciples were not required to fast. The disciples didn't have to worry about amen, the prayer life that would later come. But here, they were with the master. Here, this devil knew, praise the Lord, that they weren't fully equipped to do everything that, praise the Lord, that they needed to do. If you don't have faith, you can't please God, the Bible says. It takes faith to move God, to move whatever situation that may come in our lives. Here is the example of this dumb spirit, a man that would take this child and even throw him in the fire, throw him in the water, try to drown him from a, a man, an infant. But here... Praise the Lord. They said, we're going to take him to Jesus. Yeah. Praise the Lord. They said, we took him to your disciples, but they couldn't do anything about it. Yeah. Sometimes you go as far as you can go. Yeah. Praise the Lord. When you, amen, went as far as you can go, man's uh, uh, screaming is God's opportunity, amen, to bless us. Yeah. Praise the Lord. When you have done all that you can do, yeah. praise the Lord, you went as far as you can go. Praise the Lord, you've done everything that you know to do. Praise the Lord, don't forget about the one who sent you on the journey in the first place. Praise the Lord, Jesus said, just bring him to me. I understand, praise the Lord. Amen, he told the disciples, how long do I have to put up with you? How long, oh faithless generation, when you ought to be believing me, you're still, amen, talking about I don't know yet. Praise the Lord. You're still talking about, praise the Lord, it'll come after a while. But Jesus said, how long will I have to put up with you? Praise the Lord. God's trying to tell us something today. Praise the Lord. When you get your faith in order and when you get things the way it ought to be, praise the Lord, God can move some stuff in your life. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Every born again child of God now, you ought to be able to get a prayer through. Praise the Lord, you ought to be able to tell the devil where to go, and he'll have to go. He's given you power, praise the Lord, over every work of the devil, over every enemy. God said, I've given you power. Yeah. 
He said, after that, the Holy Ghost has come on you. You shall receive power. Power, do the most power. Power, praise the Lord, over the devil. Power over the enemy. Power over all the works. Amen. Everything this devil can throw against you, praise the Lord. Jesus said, I give you power. Praise the Lord. Don't you think that the devil ain't going to try you? Don't you think that he ain't going to put an obstacle in your way? Don't you think he ain't going to cause you, amen, that want to turn around? Praise the Lord. But he's doing what he was designed to do. He's trying to take away your faith. Hallelujah. He's trying to take away your faith. But when Jesus, amen, the devil saw Jesus, something about when the devil see Jesus, you know he can see him in you. Pray, Lord, the devil see you coming and he knows, pray the Lord, his trouble is on the way. Pray the Lord, the devil say trouble is on the way. Pray the Lord, he looked at it and said, all I see is trouble. And when he saw Jesus, he started reacting right away. Hey, Lord, he was going to try to hold on, amen, to this child. But the devil knew he had to turn him loose because Jesus was there. When the master shows up, praise the Lord, everybody else got to take a back seat. Praise the Lord, when the boss man shows up. Nothing else anybody else said matter. When the boss man shows up, the boss man showed up and said, bring it to me. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The devil tried to react. Pray, Lord, that's what he do to us. Pray, Lord, you say it look like things ought to get better, but it ain't getting no better. Praise the Lord, hallelujah, I prayed. Praise the Lord, and I fast about it. Praise the Lord, it looked like it ain't getting no better. But I'm here to tell you, hold on. Praise the Lord, hold on to your faith. Hold on to what you know. Hold on to what you've been taught. Hold on to God's unchanging hand. If it don't come today, it'll be there tomorrow. And if it don't come tomorrow, it'll be there next week. You just keep holding until God bring you out. Yeah. Hallelujah. The devil sought to destroy this child. He hadn't done nothing against the devil. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. But the devil don't care about that. He don't care about how righteous you live. He don't care about how close you want to be to God. Hey, Lord, his job is to make sure you don't make it. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. He's trying to make sure you don't get where you're trying to go. He's going to make sure, praise the Lord, that whatever you trust God for, there'll be some doubt in your mind. There'll be some doubt in your heart. And Jesus said, oh, faith this generation. When you're going to trust me? When you're going to know I'm able? Praise the Lord. I believe God's able to do anything. Praise the Lord. I think he can do anything. Are y'all whipping today? God can do anything. The Bible says, is there anything too hard for God? God can move any mountain out of the way. He can raise in the valley. Pray, Lord, that you might go through. But David said, do I walk to the valley? The shot of death. I don't feel no evil. Because he knows how to get in the valley with me. Hallelujah. Amen. Sometimes the valley is there to raise you to a place you'll never get to without the valley. Pray, Lord, without a little trouble, you'll never get where God's trying to take you. Sometimes he got to take you to the valley to get you to the mountaintop. Pray, the Lord, God's got to take you through trouble. He got to take you through some disappointments. He got to take you through some sickness, some pain. But God's trying to bring you somewhere. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He said, how long has it been like this? Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord said, if thou canst believe all things are possible. If thou canst believe 
Praise the Lord. Daddy, if you can believe, praise the Lord. All things are possible. He looked at him and said, Lord, I believe, but help my unbelief. Amen. Will you just be up straight with the Lord? You know, and stop trying to, amen, make the Lord think you, you got it all together. But tell the Lord, I got some unbelief in me. I got some stuff you got to work out of me. I got some stuff I ain't trusting you like I ought to. But would you help me? Would you help me? Would you help me? Hallelujah. Help me to trust you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. I'm in my valley. I'm in my valley. And I don't trust you like I'm supposed to in my valley. But I need some help, Lord. I need some help out of this valley. I need some help out of this trouble. Praise the Lord. I need some help. So I want you to help me. Help my unbelief. When I don't believe it like I ought to. And it's impeding my progress. You help me, Jesus. You help me, Jesus. And God will help us. Hallelujah. The Lord didn't, didn't have to keep fussing with the devil. <laughs> Come out of him, I say. Come out of him, I say. He just spoke the word. I said, you come out of me, you dumb spirit. Come out of it. Hallelujah. And the devil didn't just stop then, but he kept on fighting. He kept on struggling, trying to hold on. Hey, hallelujah. But Jesus had already spoken the word. And if Jesus speak the word on you, I don't care what the devil try to do. He can't hold on no longer. Praise the Lord. He might try to scare you up. Praise the Lord. But the bottom line is, Jesus is going to make a way. Jesus is going to fix it. Jesus is going to make a way. He already got an open door. He already got a place picked out for you. He said, when your temptations come in like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord will lift up a stand against it. I don't care how much the devil try to take you under. He can't take you under. I don't care how much he try to make you backslide. You ain't going to backslide when you love God. Hallelujah. Satan lost his last attempt to hold on. Hallelujah. Come out of it. You dumb foul spirit. Hallelujah. Call him all out his name. But matter of fact, that was him. He just described him. You dumb, you foul spirit. Come out of it. Hallelujah. Come out of it. Loose yourself from him. Hallelujah. The man, the young child, felt like he was dead. Folks are saying he's dead now. Praise the Lord. Jesus killed the boy. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. They didn't know the boy had just got delivered. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Just got set free. He had just got the victory over the enemy that had been trying to destroy him for many years. But when Jesus spoke the word, Satan had to turn him loose. Satan had to let him go. Jesus took him by the hand, reached out and got him. He rose up. Hallelujah. He ain't dead. Praise the Lord. He's more alive now than he's ever been. When Jesus bless you, when God saved you, when God filled you with the Holy Ghost, you're more alive than you've ever been. For the Lord said, you who were dead and trespasses and sins, he has made you alive. He has quickened you with the power of the Holy Ghost. You need the Holy Ghost to make it in this journey. You need the power. You need 
the power. Folks are trying to live right without the power. Hallelujah. And we're quick to say what we're going to do. You don't know what you do without the Holy Ghost. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Don't fool yourself. Don't fool yourself. Man, don't you think that you all that? Praise the Lord. Without God. Psalm say, I can do nothing. Without God, I'll fail. Without God, I'll be like a ship without a sail. Without God, I'll never succeed. Hallelujah. And breaking the stronghold of the enemy. And the Lord has given us the power to endure, to endure as good soldiers. Oh, hallelujah. Did you know you was a soldier? Hallelujah. You were in the army. Hallelujah. Did you know you were in the army? You were in the army of the Lord. You were in God's army. Praise the Lord. You were in the army of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And when you come up against the enemy, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You, you might tell him you come against me with your sword. You come against me with your shield. But I come against you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I come against you to destroy your, amen, stronghold. I come against you to tear down the wall that you built before me. I come as I come in power. I come in power. I come with authority. I don't come on my own. Hey, Lord Jesus said, I didn't come to do my own will. I come to do the will of him that sent me. Don't you think Jesus was on his own? But he said, I come to do the will of my father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. When we call on Jesus, somebody will say, he'll answer prayer. When you call on Jesus, he'll answer prayer. When you call him like you need it, he'll answer prayer. When you call him, when you call him, when you call him, when you call him, when you call him. Hallelujah. 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 When you call it, when you call it, you activate your faith. When you call it, your faith comes alive. When you call it, demons tremble. When you call it, pray Lord, the devil can't do nothing with you. When you call it, Jesus, 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 Jesus. thinks he's got us on this thumb. I'm here to tell every demon wherever he is I'm making a declaration hallelujah that no enemy can destroy my faith. No enemy can take me down. No enemy that comes against me will be able to prosper. No enemy Pray, Lord, that sit by hell can do anything with the saint of God. God can bless you even in your weakness. Woo, even in your weakness. God said, I'll give you power over your enemy. Pray, Lord, the devil said, I got him weak now. I got him weak now. Pray, the Lord, I got him where I want to. But I'm here to tell you, when you stand up and call on the name of Jesus, 
even in your weakness. God said, I'll give you power over all the works of the devil. Not some of them, all of them. All of them. I don't want power over some of them. I want the power over all of them. Praise the Lord when you can speak to him and tell him, come out. Behold me. His daughter no longer. Can't hold this son no longer. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you today your divine word there's strength and power in your word faith that breaks the stronghold of the enemy thank you Lord thank you Lord thank you for it Jesus I pray salvation in this house those who are listening by way of social media bring salvation in the name of Jesus, do it with your strong arm, and we'll praise you for it. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Come on, give the Lord a praise today. Glory. Hallelujah. Now, Lord, there's someone in this house today. Don't to have the Holy Ghost stand with me briefly. I want to give an opportunity for those who have not received the power. I want you to know it's available to everybody. God makes no discrimination. Sometimes folks say, I've done too much. I went too far. God can't save me. I'm here to tell you that's not true. That's just a ploy of the enemy to make you feel like God can't do it. But the Lord clearly says, faith. If you can believe all things, all things, all things, saints. I don't care how long you've been suffering with it. How long the enemy been tormenting you. And I come by to tell you all things. You can believe all things are possible. To him that will believe. If you have a situation today. You want the Lord to deliver set you free from come 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 now come come swiftly come praise the Lord come while the Lord is calling hallelujah don't be ashamed don't let nobody stop you because nobody can do this for you but Jesus praise the Lord folks talking about the Lord Folks criticized Jesus, and he was the Lord of Lords, the King of Kings. Certainly they're going to criticize you. Come on, let the Lord bless you today. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Doesn't matter how long. Doesn't matter how long. Hallelujah. Get your breakthrough today. Get your breakthrough today. Just come wherever you are. Come wherever you are. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, we bless your name. 